Today we're going to talk about moving headlines in org mode around. A lot of times I'll make lots of headlines uh, in my blog posts or in organizing something and then I need to rearrange them in a, in a fast way. And org mode is pretty good for this. You can use alt up to move headlines around. Uh, you can use alt up and down like this. Uh, but a lot of times if I have to move it a long distance I find myself collapsing it, killing it, moving somewhere, and pasting it back. Um, and I do that a lot. So today I want to look at a new idea of teleporting the headline into the place that I want. So I got this idea from Lispy where you can put your cursor at the beginning of a, a Lisp expression and press T and then it gives you an IV-like completion for where to teleport that headline to. So that's what we're going to look at and the, the basic idea is you put your cursor at, uh, at headline and we'll, we'll make a short key that will kill it and then give me an IV completion to where I want to put it. So let's look at the code uh, to do that. It's pretty pretty straightforward. So I'll define an org teleport function and give it an optional uh, prefix arg so we can put the headline either before where we jump or after. The default will be after. And the idea will be we mark the subtree, kill it, and then this single line will give me a very brief uh, set of bindings to jump to a particular headline. And if we're before, we just yank it. And if we're after, then we mark the current subtree so we have an easy way to get to the end, uh, check that we're not at the end of a buffer, and then we paste it again, and then I like it to be hidden. So that's the function, and we'll just add a few uh, speed keys for org mode now. So I'm going to add three here. The first one is M to mark the subtree. The second one is to kill the subtree, and the third one will be to, uh, to teleport it. So let me just run these, and, uh, and then we'll go through uh, what each one does. So back up here, if I'm at the beginning of a, of a subtree, I can press M now, and it marks the whole subtree. I could press K, and it will kill it, and then I could you know, move it wherever I want uh, and paste it. But I can also use uh, trans uh, teleport now, so if I press capital T, then it gives me these markers here, and so let's say I want to put it after uh, after F, then I do that and it pastes it automatically down here at the end. Or if I want it to go before D, then uh, let's see, let's put it after, uh, after B. If I wanted to say B before B, I have to type Control U and then T, and then I press D, and it puts it in, in the middle. So it takes a little uh, getting used to the, the whole IV way of doing things, but it allows me to uh, transport headlines uh, kind of all over the place. And interestingly, if you have a really big um, org file and you want to move something at the end, something at the beginning, a limitation of IV is it only shows you what's visible. But if I look at uh, this here, now when I press T, I get candidates in both windows. So if this was at the end of the file, I would be able to pick something at the end of the file and move it to the beginning of the file or vice versa. So once you can see what you want to move and where you want to move it to, this teleport function is pretty handy. That's it for today.